Hi, in this problem we're going to find the equation of the tangent line to the graph of this function at the point 3 comma 0 0.3. This function is called a serpentine. Let's go ahead and work through its solution. So to find the equation of the tangent line, we need a point and a slope. So because the tangent line and the function share a point, and this is the point they share, we already have the point, so that part is done. We just need the slope of the tangent line. Okay, so the slope of the tangent line is going to be the derivative of the function. Um, in this case, we want the tangent line at this ordered pair. So the slope of the tangent line is going to be the derivative at three. So we just have to find the derivative of this function and then plug in three. So this is a fraction, so we're going to use the quotient rule. So recall the quotient rule says if you have f over g and you take the derivative, you could think of f as your top function and g as your bottom function, and it's the derivative of the top times the bottom minus the top times the derivative of the bottom all over the bottom one squared. So here, y prime is going to be, so I'm gonna write it again over here so we can see it. It's x over one plus x squared. That's our function. So the derivative of the top is going to be one times the bottom, so one plus x squared that's the g, minus the top, times the derivative of the bottom. So the derivative of one is zero, the derivative of x squared is two x. It's all being divided by the bottom one squared, so one plus x squared squared. Again, it's the derivative of the top times the bottom, minus the top times the derivative of the bottom, which is just two x over the bottom one squared. So y prime is equal to, let's see, one times all of this is just all of that. Minus, and then x times x is two x squared, so this would be minus two x squared. All over parentheses, one plus x squared squared. There's a one x squared here, so this will be one, and then one x squared minus two x squared is minus x squared. And that's all over one plus x squared squared. All right, so that's the derivative. So we need the derivative at three. So we have to plug in three into all of this. So y prime of three is one minus, well, three squared is nine. So it's one minus nine over and one plus nine squared. So this is going to be one minus nine is negative eight over, and then this will be 10 squared, so 100. So let's see, four goes into eight twice, and it goes into 125 times. So negative two over 25, that's the, that's the slope here. M is negative two over 25. And our point, recall, was three comma 0.3. So now that we have our point and our slope, we can find our tangent line. So recall, the formula is y minus y1 equals m parentheses x minus x1. So this is y minus, this is y1 and this is x1. So it's y minus 0 0.3 equals m, which is negative two over 25 and then x minus x1, so x minus three. And I am just going to leave it like this. I'm not gonna solve for y, because the numbers are not very fun. And that would be the final answer. I hope this video has been helpful to someone. Good luck.